This is WCPO 9 News. Thanks for joining us for WCPO 9 News. I'm Tanya O'Rourke. Let's take a look at some of today's top stories. Anyone 16 or older in Ohio will be eligible to get a coronavirus vaccine starting March 29th. Governor Mike DeWine says the arrival of more doses makes this possible to offer the shot to more people. On Friday, people 40 and older will be eligible, along with people who suffer from cancer, heart disease, and obesity. In Indiana, anyone 45 or older became eligible for a vaccine yesterday. You can schedule your appointment by heading to ourshot.in.gov. You can also call 211 or reach out to your local pharmacy to schedule an appointment directly with them. In Kentucky, Phase 1C opened on Monday, and that means anyone 16 and over with conditions that the CDC says might cause severe COVID illness can get a shot. And that includes people with type 1 diabetes, hypertension, and other diseases, as well as those who are overweight, but does not include smokers. Signs of coronavirus antibodies are showing up more frequently in blood donations. The American Red Cross reports more than 20% of donations from unvaccinated people for the first week of March showed COVID-19 antibodies. The Red Cross says the presence of antibodies does not confirm infection or immunity, but does indicate a person was likely exposed to the virus. Kentucky lawmakers have passed a state budget, but they still have to decide how to spend $2.4 billion. The Commonwealth's government will get as part of the new stimulus package. The legislative session ends in late March. All right, we are starting off mostly cloudy for your Wednesday, looking at highs into the mid 60s. We are expecting some chances of rain, mostly starting in the evening, but we'll see more of that rain coming in the overnight hours. Potential for some severe weather as well as we do head into the overnight hours. Here's a look at your extended forecast and we're dropping down on Friday and then 50s by the weekend.